everyone, I'm Felicia and I'm a global retail trainer at Love Bonito. So today is a very exciting day. We're actually kickstarting our Train the Trainers week at our Funan store. So we are flying down all of our trainers from different parts of the world. So we have someone obviously from Singapore, then Malaysia, Indonesia, Hong Kong and also the Philippines because we recently opened a store there, right? The trainers will be bringing back lots of like new knowledge because they'll be actually experiencing firsthand with the new product launches and also like new training modules as well that they'll be then going back to their markets to train their local retail teams. And this will translate into better customer service on the shop floors all over the world for all of you there shopping with us at Love Bonito. So far the training is very impactful for the staff because we have to know a neckline, we have to know a body shape. It makes the staff confident to explain to a customer. I was looking forward to a neckline because the neckline is so many different in LB. We have much to do with to customer and make confident the customer is it. So I think I uh, found the training very insightful, especially as uh, coming from PH, a new market. Um, there's still a lot for us to learn about Love Bonito and the customers there. But this was a good way to, I guess, standardize, equip us more to give us more sound recommendations to our customers. I think the most interesting part is understanding the different necklines as well as the different silhouettes, which really helped me to be able to share more information to the girls whenever I go for training with them as well. I think challenging portion will be really looking at the theory versus the actual item. Really be able to identify, oh, actually, based on theory, this is uh, maybe a shift dress and then in reality if we look at the product itself how can we identify oh yes this is a shift dress based on the theory in comparison to the reality itself I was really impressed with all the trainers uh, that came down today they brought with them with a lot of knowledge before even attending the training and what I really enjoyed is them also sharing their local nuances um, some of them finding similarities as well in their own markets oh in Hong Kong it's the same too or like in Philippines as well that was quite like a nice sharing session also and just learning from each other. What I'm looking forward to in the next half of the day is really like seeing the trainers in action on the shop floor. That makes up a huge part of what we do on a daily basis as a retail trainer. Doing store visits, um, coaching the staff um, on the job and just also doing like real life like role play scenarios as well just to check in on the learnings from trainings and what they've applied on the shop floor. We got them to actually take their body measurements for each other for like shoulders, bars, waist and also like hips and then they can then find out hey actually am I an hourglass or maybe a triangle body shape, rectangle or inverted triangle then we talked about what kind of styles to recommend these body types as well. I'm from Malaysia, that's why actually uh, the food is similar with Singapore but I still prefer Malaysian food, it's nicer. <laughs> My favourite was the carrot cake. Yes. Obviously, it's empty. Yeah. Uh, I wanted to lick off everything from the plate. Today I have joined the Iron Store Daily Briefing and I think it is quite important we gather all the staff together and to let them join the Daily Briefing, get the most update information and then during the Daily Briefing and I find that most staff is quite encouraging, also can enhance the uh, atmosphere of the store. Thank you for joining us today. We hope to see all of you in our stores next time. Bye! Bye.